Hi, this is Grace Kim from Scamato Workshop, and I'm standing in front of a building called Capitol Hill Urban Co-Housing, a building I've designed and live in. Uh, my office is on the ground floor, and I'd like to take you on a little tour. So this entry where it used to just be a corridor to enter into the building, um, but with the pandemic, we actually put in these bistro tables so that we could have meals in a space that is covered and protected from rain, um, but there is adequate airflow back and forth um, through this corridor because this is an outside, unconditioned space. At the end of the corridor, we have this mural that the community put together. Um, we did this actually before we moved in, um, in two foot sections, and we didn't know what it would look like before it was finished. Um, and then after the building was complete, we came and put it all together and saw the, how beautiful it was. Before we go up in the elevator, I just wanted to show you our on-site on parking. This is the only parking that we have and it's exclusively obviously for bikes. Um, the nine households have a fair number of bikes per each household. We're fortunate because my husband and business partner, Mike, likes to work on the bikes and make sure twice a year that they are in tip-top shape for everyone to get out and ride. So on the next floor up we have the common house and in the common house we have a full kitchen in which we can prepare meals um, for the whole community. We do this, or pre-COVID we did this three times a week um, and teams of two or three people would prepare the meal. Sometimes the kids would take a turn to prepare the meal for the community. And then in this space, we also have a large dining room that can seat all 27 of us and our guests. The dining room gets used for um, birthday celebrations and parties. And in the nice summer months, we eat outside in the courtyard. Um, the courtyard is also a place of activities all year round uh, for kids and for grown-ups. Um, this is a summer concert that we had the summer before COVID. So our walkways are designed um, outdoors so that residents can see who's coming and going. Um, there's not only enough room here for um, emergency egress to get to the front doors of each of the homes, but also the, um, the stairs and the elevator. But there's a little bit of extra space so that people can put chairs and tables out, um, as well as some plants and things to personalize. Uh, this space allows residents to sit and visit with one another. It's a good spot to have coffee in the morning or um, in the afternoon. The other nice opportunity here is that looking over into the courtyard, you can see a lot of activity um, that happens just below. The courtyard is used by kids to play, but it's also used to celebrate various um, cultural holidays. Um, it's also a space that gets played in in the wintertime. Um, we had a very big snowstorm a couple of weeks ago. Um, it's also a place to celebrate in the evenings, in the summertime, um, and it's just uh, a good place to, to see and be seen by our neighbors. From the upper roof, you can see our garden and our balconies and courtyard below. And at the top of the stack of the outdoor balconies is our crow's nest. Um, it's a space that we use to sit and have drinks after work or just hang out to talk with our neighbors or have dinner with our family. Adjacent to the crow's nest is our PV array where we generate power for the common areas of our building. And looking down from the crow's nest, you can see um, the dining or the outdoor seating space that we have upstairs as well as um, a little bit closer look at our, at our farm. Um, we call it our farm because it produces quite a lot of food um, and um, it's been a great place to socialize during COVID, um, staying uh, physically distant but um, socially connected. Uh, even during the winter time when the garden is fallow, um, we still are taking the time to be upstairs together. Um, um, the seating area upstairs gets used quite often uh, not necessarily for community meals, but for impromptu meals in between. Um, so it's quite often that we see our neighbors upstairs. Um, thanks so much for joining us for a tour of Capitol Hill Urban Co-housing here in Seattle, Washington. 
Hope you enjoy the rest of your day and that you're able to come and visit us.